In this video, I'm going to be modeling for you how to plan for success criteria. And I'm going to do that using this success criteria development sheet, which you'll also be using to plan for your success criteria. The first task on this sheet is to answer the question, what task am I using to assess mastery? And the task that I'm going to be using is a worksheet on answering an ACE question. It's based on the poem Dreams by Langston Hughes. And so it asks for an ACE, question, ACE answer to the question in the poem, what message is the author conveying about dreams? So I'm gonna copy and paste that. And then here I will put an ACE answer to the question. So now I'm ready to move on to the next part. And it says, how would I, the expert, complete this task? And in parentheses, it says, actually complete the task. So I'm not gonna do that here. I'm gonna do it on my actual worksheet. So I'll just type C attached here. And then I'll go over to my worksheet and actually complete this assignment. So the question is, in the poem, what message is the author conveying about dreams? So I'll read the poem. Hold fast to dreams, for if dreams die, life is a broken winged bird that cannot fly. Hold fast to dreams, for when dreams go, life is a barren field frozen with snow. So the answer to my question, what message is the author conveying, would be the message that the author is conveying that you cannot live life as intended or that life will be unfulfilling if you allow your dreams to die. Okay, so then the next part, I have to cite, and I know that in order to cite, I'm gonna provide text evidence for my text, and I need to make sure to introduce the text using a sentence stem. So I know that I've provided my students already with a list of sentence stems um, that are not on this page, but you might wanna make sure you have that when you present to students. So going back into my model, I'm going to write, this is seen in the text when it states, or when, Dreams go, life is a barren field frozen with snow. And I'm going to do it exactly how I want my students to do it. Since there's no page numbers, I'll just put my citation. All right. And so then the last part, of course, is the elaboration. And I want to elaborate uh, properly. This is important, using the sentence starter again, because a field is meant to grow things and be productive if it is frozen it can't do that if life is without dreams being met it will be just like that frozen field. 